so I've got some news. Um, it's upsetting, um, especially with, you know, these days with this uh, coronavirus. Um, well, let me start out. It's with Wet and Wild. <laughs> Oh my goodness, it's, it's kind of infuriating. Okay, so they put out a l extremely limited time, limited amount of their leftover promotional boxes of Jungle Rock. Um, if they would have did that from the beginning, I would have gotten it. But I am so into crocheting, I just, I just can't be frivolous and... I didn't get it and it sold out uh, like in half a day now it was I think it was $98 and but the box did as far as I could tell did not have the jungle rock bag they only had um, the makeup um for the whole collection including the makeup it was 85 but they were selling this for 98 without the bag so that kind of got me upset right there but in their defense they were giving sixty dollars to the ocean conservatory or something um so that sold out in half a day um without the bag for 98 um you know as much as i would have liked the box i was not about to spend another hundred dollars on a collection i already had just for the box um, and the very next day they announced and this was probably, um, not available, but available to pre buy probably from the beginning of the month. But I, you know, I, I don't know for sure, but I know because Yesterday was the 15th, and Wet n Wild announced what their summer collection is going to be. It is the Fantasy Maker Collection, <laughs> but it's called the Neon Collection. There's nothing neon in the collection, but it's very sparkly. And uh, if you look up uh, Neon, Wet n Wild, Fantasy Makers, Neon Collection, Wet n Wild, Neon Collection, it will not come up if you try to link it they put a link on a 24 hour video that they did in the on instagram they put a link you have to go you click on the wet and wild logo on instagram and those videos are only for about 24 hours and there's a link it doesn't work. It worked on the computer the first time I tried it, and I was on my way out. I had to do groceries. I had to run errands, and my husband, you know, took lunch. I couldn't, you know, wait, but I just found out right before lunch. It was very frustrating. So the link worked, and the, the first thing I noticed, because I was in a rush, but the first thing I noticed that they really don't have they have maybe it looked like less than 50 percent of the collection available it is a huge collection it is a huge collection just like fantasy makers it's a huge collection what they announced was it would be available it would be available at it's exclusive to walmart and it would be available at walmart.com and it will be on display in the store this day and age, people aren't going out because of the coronavirus. And it's not fair of what and while to make people go crazy and search for this. This is like, you know, trying to find all their other collections and going on a huge runaround before we had to go to CVS, you had to go to Walgreens, you had to just go everywhere. Maybe HEB had it, maybe they didn't go to your local, you know, Christmas tree shops and all those other shops and... And, you know, it was a wild goose chase. That's not something that they should be doing right now at this time. Um, that's number one. Number two is, 
like I said, less than 50% of the collection was available. Maybe 30%, I would say, was available. Maybe. Um, they, they are, I could tell that they're, it seems that they're discontinuing their liquid um, eyeshadows. So, what it looks like to me is that they just relabeled them um, under this Fantasy Makers neon collection, or it looks more like a sparkle collection. Um, I was really hoping that they would bring back roller coasters. Now that they did this for the summer, I don't even know if they're going to have this for Halloween like they usually do. I don't know if the roller coaster is in this collection because you could barely tell when you look online. Um, I went to my local Walmart because, like I said, we were running errands and my husband needed something for work. So I went in there, took a quick look around and left. Wasn't there. Um, that really pissed me off. That really infuriated me that... I'm hoping that maybe the whole collection will be available online. But the way that with Walgreens, the way it's been in the past, it's usually not. And if you're lucky enough to see it in a store, one girl says she did see it in her store over the weekend. Mine did not have it. But if you're lucky enough to find it, you know they're not going to have five of each color. I really, I don't, unless they do like the other years that they've had a big floor display. Because it looks like that's what this is going to need. How many to each color they're going to have, I don't know. Because I know one year it was just two of each color. So, um, I just, I, I, it took, when I got back, it took me a while before I was like, should I, should I even try and get this or not? I was just really mad that they would do this. A lot of people were mad at them. You know, they should make this available on their website. They shouldn't be doing it this way. Usually they don't have a box collection. They only have a promotional haunted house box that they send to certain people. I don't anticipate a box collection for this. And I really hope that they don't get it because um, that kind of happened to me with their pump collection. I got everything at CVS and then they came out with a, a, a big bag. You know, it was like 160 bucks, but it was a bag and it had a towel. It had a water bottle. And it had the entire collection. I didn't buy the entire collection, but I did about 75% of it. And had already spent about $100 on that collection at CVS using coupons and stuff. So that was last January. And then, you know, maybe a, a month later, less than a month later, they came out with the bag collections. Um, they come out with small box collections for the Fantasy Maker with only certain colors. The big box only goes as promotional to a big haunted house box to whoever they want to promote it, you know. So I sat there, I was so mad. They have, I think, eight eyeshadow palettes. I mean, this is a really big collection. It looked like they had 10 liquid eyeshadows, uh, maybe 10 lip glosses. They had uh, glitter liners, they had lip glosses um and highlighters they had some gems for the faces uh not they look to me like the same thing they do for halloween but maybe in a different packaging um uh, they had like a face spray just like they did for um halloween which is just their regular it was their rose face spray it just relabeled and um I'm sitting there thinking, I know for sure I'm, I'm not going to get this entire collection. I'm pretty sure this has a bunch of repeats. I'm almost positive their liquid uh, metallic uh, eyeshadows were just their regular line re-promoted. From what I can see on the website, I could not find one that was the same color as Roller Ghoster. Uh, which was an orange color. At first, I thought it was the same thing as Copper Cat, and it wasn't. Uh, Copper Cat is like a red, coppery color. This is like a really, was a really orangey color. And I went to go buy it on the next paycheck, and they ran out the day before. So I'm really pissed about that. 
um, and it doesn't look like they have it in this collection. From what I could see, because you could barely tell online, you know, and so uh, they they had like basically like two of everything two colors available out of the 10 or out of the five or you know like they just had hardly anything collect um available um to sell online now the reason why i know this must have been a pre pre-order well it already said this it said pre-order um by the 14th and wet and wild announced it until the 15th so i'm gonna assume that this was available by you know probably by the beginning of the month to pre-order but pre-order what they've done this before if they don't have a color available they don't have a color available and usually they're not going to get it so if you can't find it in the store you're lucked out it was a huge collection and like i said only like two colors of the whole between five to ten colors in each thing. I mean, it was a lot were available to pre-order. So that was really frustrating. And then, you know, like I said, my husband had to get something for work and it wasn't there. So I'm just sitting here thinking, I'm not, I don't want to be going from Walmart to Walmart for this. You know, I, I, I just, I'm exhausted. And I, because I just stress out every time I'm trying to find stuff that we need for the family during these crazy times and um and i'm in you know i'm into crocheting again and you know i bought a bunch of yarn and containers for my yarn i have like five projects lined up i'm we're not going anywhere all doctor's appointments have been canceled so it's just crazy and for them to do that it's just so not right it is really not right so um I'm just sitting here thinking, how am I going to be able to, to get this? Um, I just, I just finally just said, I'm just going to get, you know, the coolest toned colors that are available that I can find in, in each category. Um, I didn't get every category because it was, I didn't get the gemstones. I didn't get the face sprays. Um, so, you know, I just, I think they might've had like maybe two cool tone maybe two warm tones of the glosses i think they were like 10 different color glosses if not more so i got the two cool tones um the only thing i was going to skip was the liquid metallics because they had only two warm colors and one i think one taupey color and i was like didn't they have like a taupey color already um and i was not about to go through my, one of the things i one of the projects i wanted to do was organize all my makeup and I was about to go look through all my makeup I've just been obsessed with crocheting um, and um, I'm already uh, a third done with my next blanket it's a big blanket too I'm about a third done and um, I just don't want to do anything but crochet <laughs> I got things to do too next week I really got to get on the ball with organizing I still haven't put the dogs uh, rabies collars uh, tags on their collars um i'm just crocheting 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 well you know home doing just home mostly and um so i just decided i said i don't feel like going through my makeup i just decided to uh just get the taupe one um so it looks like there's one color there that was purple that might have come out in their spring goth collection two years ago I'm not 100% sure um, because I haven't double checked everything. I think I need to do an inventory. <laughs> but anyway, um, nothing was available. The click stopped. Oh, and by the way, the link stopped working on the computer. Uh, last time I, I did the link on my phone and it works. It worked on my phone, but not on my computer. So uh it's this is i think it's gonna be one of those things that's just gonna frustrate everybody out of their mind trying to get uh i'll keep checking to see what comes available online um i was just hoping to relax today as yesterday i was out all, all day i was ex I'm exhausted 
but my son needs to go to the post office and he still hasn't gotten his driver's license. Um, he still had like a lesson left uh, with the whatever driver place. Uh, and with all that's happening, everything's on hold. So I got to, you know, I let, I let him drive for the practice, go to the post office. And I said, you know what? I'm going to go to the other Walmart. They usually have this before any of the other Walmarts. So I was going to try there, but um, it's like really the only place that I I, um, I could think that will have it. Um, so this is just going to be frustrating. Uh, it just really, really turned me off. Um, I'm tired. The situation is very stressful that we're in, and for them to do that, and sometimes they listen and sometimes they don't. I'm just hoping that they will have it on the website. Whether they're going to do a full Fantasy Makers collection too, I don't know. But I was just really hoping to get my hands on roller coaster. That's the only color I didn't get last year. And now this this collection. And I have no idea how, how we're going to get it. Um, unless I find a Walmart that has a complete collection. And... Um, only one I know of in the area is the one, the, not the one right across from me, the one about maybe five miles down the road from me. So I'm going to go there today, but I, I don't really have high hopes to finding this collection. It's, and with this time, what's happening, I just, I don't really know what's going to happen. But, um, anyway, so that's the news. I, you know, took pictures that I'll probably post, but I don't know. Sometimes when in a while, there's the stupidest things, and I feel like they took two step backwards with this one. Um, they really, you know, they really need to like stop this bull crap. You know, this with what's happening now, they really need to like have these things on their website for those of us that are wet and wild collectors. So. Um, just right now, just turned off. I'm just tired from the stress of the situation that we're living in today, this day and age, at this time of, 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 of this pandemic. And I'm just, it's just really turned me off. But anyway, um, you know, I always hold on to hope that there'll be a solution, that they will hear everybody's complaints, that they will listen, that they will have it available on their website and then maybe I can try to get the other colors but yeah I just I ordered um, just the coolest tone colors they had from this collection um, and I know Walmart saying that it could be you know sh everybody's shipping delayed nowadays because of the crisis that we're in so um, they said the delivery date should be the 24th so I believe that's next Friday. So let's see what happens with that. But maybe you can make your voices heard. Maybe you can go on their Instagram, their Facebook. I'm thinking of giving them a call, even though you know, when you give them a call, they're like, yeah, okay, we'll pass it on. It's like, so that's what's happening right now. So if you want the summer fantasy makers collection, uh, check Walmart. Keep checking Walmart.com. Uh, make your voice heard through social media. And see if maybe they'll put it on their website too. And you know, with the way they do things, they might have a box set later on. But uh, anyway, who knows? Maybe this is... No, it couldn't be their Halloween collection too. Because it's like all bright and sparkly. Halloween is more like dark and sinister, so to speak. Uh, anyway, okay, so... That's the story with that, and I will see you guys next week. Bye.